ஹலோ ஆல் வெல்கம் டு மை யூடியூப் சேனல் பிகே கெமிஸ்ட்ரி இந்த ப்ரீவியஸ் லெக்சர் வி டிஸ்கஸ்ட் ஹாப்மன் ரீஅரேஞ்ச்மெண்ட் கர்டியஸ் ரீஅரேஞ்ச்மெண்ட் ஸ்கிமிட் ரீஅரேஞ்ச்மெண்ட் இன் திஸ் லெக்சர் வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு டிஸ்கஸ் த லாஸ் அண்ட் ரீஅரேஞ்ச்மெண்ட் இட்ஸ் அ கன்வர்ஷன் ஆஃப் ஹைட்ராக்சிலமிக் ஆசிட் இன் டு அமீன் என் கஸ் திஸ் இஸ் ஹைட்ராக்சிலமிக் ஆசிட் In the presence of acid or base followed by hydrolysis gives the amine product. General mechanism or C double bond O bond N gauge bond O gauge leaving group this is activation step so minus hx gives the or c double bond o bond n gauge bond o lg lg means leaving group okay the next step is base or c double bond o bond n minus bond o lg so now the migration of alkyl into electron deficient nitrogen at the same time the elimination of olg so now what you will get is c double bond o double bond n bond or so this is isocyanide if if you hydrolyze this isocyanate you will get the amine product let's discuss some examples hydroxamic acid presence of para toluene sulfonic acid base followed by hydrolysis the next step is formation of isocyanate followed by hydrolysis gives the amine product so the next example is acid react with hydroxylamine hydrochloride to form a hydro hydroxamic acid c double bond o bond o bond n gauge bond o gauge the presence of base it will converted into amine the same way the acid will converted into the amine presence of hydroxyl amine and potassium hydroxide let's discuss this example this i collected from organic letter journal so the hydroxyamic acid in the presence of cdi acetonitrile then benzyl alcohol what is the product what is cdi cdi is nothing but carbonyl dimidazole so what will happen if you react with this carbonyl dimidazole in the first step it will attack the carbonyl position then leaves the one imidazole the next step is presence of base it will abstract the proton or c bond o minus bond n bond o c double bond o bond you will get this then next step is this o minus with with uh, like the carbonyl position so then elimination of dimidazole this is dioxalo next step is elimination of carbon dioxide same time migration of or group leads to formation of isocyanate or n double bond c double bond o the next step is benzyl alcohol so what you will get or bond n gauge bond c double bond 
bond o benzoyl let's discuss this example the acyl presence of cda isotonitrile the next step is cytoxylamine hydrochloride again cda with 60 degree centigrade the final step is react with morpholine so what is the product just pause the video and try to write the answer first step cda carbonyl dimethazole isotonitrile solvent so it will attack the carbonyl position so leads to formation of next step is react with hydroxylamine hydrochloride so it will attack the carbonyl so what will get is elimination of carbon dioxide and dimethazole so leads to formation of hydroxamic acid next step is if you react with hydroxamic acid with cda heating up to 60 degree centigrade so you will get a isocyanate the fourth step is this isocyanate react with morpholine so you will get a morpholine linked product if you like this video share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel pk chemistry thank you